All right, everybody, what is up? It's Flix. Welcome back. In today's video, guys, we are talking about some new information regarding Call of Duty 2020. So I actually seen some tweets last night referring to all the information that we're getting. This came from a guy who lives in Japan. He uh, usually does tweaks and leaks about Call of Duty. It was right about Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019. So there is a lot of stuff that he has been found right about. So I'll show you guys the first tweet that was on Twitter. So this came from a guy called Victor. Um, as you guys can tell, the top bit is obviously Japanese, but they did use Google Translate, which isn't always the best, doesn't always work. But we got, this account will not tell me about the new work of COD in the future. As a Chinese, I was a little disappointed to see the content of the COD 2020 campaign. The multiplayer is played the same as MW, as Modern Warfare. Then we get a follow-up tweet from Receive Gamer saying, Do you have any news of the plan to reveal the campaign first and wait on the multiplayer? The first trailer is to promote the plot, as always. Then another guy replies saying, Zombies, how is that coming along? Also, whether it be doors, is it on Modern Warfare's engine? Please answer. He says, their own engine, not Infinity Wars. So a guy replies saying, zombies, how is that coming along? Also, whether it be doors, is it on Modern Warfare's engine? Please answer. Victor replies saying, their own engine, not Infinity Awards, which makes sense because why would Treyarch use Infinity Awards engines? Because, you know, that would make no sense. They use their own engine, but they wouldn't even be allowed, I don't think. So Dean also replies saying, what do you mean plays at the same like Modern Warfare? Skill based matchmaking, camping, big maps, Leveling system, slow and tactical gameplay, then if that's the case, I'll find it hard to play that again for another year. Victor replies saying, Modern Warfare 2.0. So now this tweet got me really, really annoyed because I was like, I don't even like Modern Warfare. And I honestly could not play a game like Modern Warfare for a long, long time. So pretty much what this is telling me from all the tweets that we're getting here is that Call of Duty 2020 is going to be like Modern Warfare 2.0 but it's going to be on Treyarch's engine rather than Infinity Wars engine. They may just keep it to the exact same um, layout like Infinity War did. They might do the exact same maps, they might do the exact same layouts, the maps might be massive. They might do um, skill based matchmaking, probably more than likely. They're going to be doors, people camping. It's just, it's not going to be a fun experience for the, the community. Like, we don't like Modern Warfare. I don't like Modern Warfare. I actually went off Call of Duty Modern Warfare to play Call of Duty World War II. And that game came out for free for PlayStation Plus. It was that good. And I enjoyed it that much compared to Modern Warfare. I actually bought the Season Pass because I wanted to play the zombies. I really love zombies. Uh, if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys go and download Call of Duty World War 2. It's free on the PlayStation Store, guys. Trust me, you'll have a blast on it. It's an amazing game. And the game is very underrated. Probably one of the most underrated CODs probably ever out. Unfortunately, it did have a rough start. But anyway, that's not what we're talking about. So... Um, there is one more final tweet guys before I end the video and I'll put it up on the screen for you guys now. So AI tweets out to Tom Henderson saying reveal before the PlayStation 5 event. Tom Henderson says honestly not sure game is not where it needs to be at, at the minute. So we're not going to be getting a reveal anytime soon for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War unfortunately. Every year. It seems like the COD reveals are getting later and later and later and later. Like, we're in the sixth month. We, we, are, we are in June, okay? And COD games usually come out now on October. For some reason, they don't go to November anymore. Most of the CODs have been October releases. We're four months away from the reveal. Maybe four months and a half from the new Call of Duty being um, released. To the public and we still haven't even got a reveal trailer we don't know anything about it like that's really late like this game could even get delayed till next year i think um i don't really know what's going to happen i'll be interested to see what 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 way it all plays out 
But to know that this game is going to be like Call of Duty Modern Warfare, there's going to be people camping, um, mounting around bloody walls, mounting on head flipping glitched spots where you can't even shoot them because they're mounting and you can't see their body, you know, camping behind doors, man, big massive maps, slow gameplay, like, I don't know if I could do it. I, I'm just going to stick to Call of Duty uh, World War 2 if that's the case because um, I'm going to have a lot of fun on that game and uh, it's actually a really, really good game. So if you guys haven't checked out that, go and download the PlayStation Store. If you have PlayStation Plus, trust me, you will not regret it. It's actually a really, really good Call of Duty game. Probably one of the most underrated COD games ever out. Anyway, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you find it very informational and you guys her stuff that you guys never heard before leave a like guys we greatly appreciate it let me know that you guys are enjoying the content that i'm producing make sure you guys do subscribe turn on post notifications so you stay up to date with all the latest and i'll try to keep you guys up to date with all the latest call of duty 2020 news anyway guys let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out guys